If you want to know the best miniseries, you should definitely watch our picks for the best ones of 2023. That woman from the bar, if we don't find her, if we don't stop her now, you won't have a family left. Number 10. Love and Death, created by David E. Kelly. Set in 1978, Texas, this series unravels the true story of Candy Montgomery, a housewife who lives a typical suburban life. But her world spirals into chaos following an affair, leading to a heinous crime that shocks her community. It's a gripping blend of crime and psychological drama, exploring the depths of human nature, moral dilemmas, and the devastating consequences of forbidden passions. That was wonderful. <sighs> Number nine. Jesus Christ. Good morning. Fuck. Good morning. Maybe don't leave this sitting out. The Crowded Room is a psychological thriller miniseries created by Akiva Goldsman. This series tells the inevitable tragedy of a young man arrested in the 70s for his role in a massacre and subsequently sent to a mental institution. Years later, he recounts his life story during a series of questionings, which gradually unveil much darker truths than anyone could have expected. Does that happen to you a lot? Sort of frequent occurrence, forgetting things? Why do you keep asking me that? People forget things all the time. I just have a not so great memory. Number eight. 7.30. You wait and see. It's, uh, magic. The Lost Flowers of Alice Hart is a drama miniseries created by Sarah Lambert. This story follows the life of a young girl whose turbulent and violent childhood casts a long shadow over her adult years. Initially appearing bright and cheerful, the discovery of bruises one day unveils a somber truth about her upbringing. As her estranged and mysterious grandmother takes custody, the story unfolds to reveal complexities and deeper layers hidden beneath the surface. Do you like flowers? Uh, yeah, yeah, I do. Well, when it does rain here, this whole place becomes a sea of desert flowers. Number seven. One is never too old to learn, Snips. Ahsoka is a science fiction action television series created by Dave Filoni. This captivating expansion of the Star Wars universe focuses on the enigmatic Ahsoka Tano and continues the beloved Star Wars Rebels animated series. Set after the fall of the Empire, it explores Ahsoka's journey as she investigates an emerging threat to a vulnerable galaxy. It blends intense action, deep lore, and character-driven storytelling, setting the stage for a wider ramifications within the Star Wars narrative. Number 6 Four deaths in a row is not a coincidence. We don't need to know how it's happening to know it's happening. We are under attack. The Fall of the House of Usher is a horror drama television miniseries created by Mike Flanagan. This series follows two ruthless siblings, determined to secure their family's fortune and future to build a lasting dynasty. However, their carefully constructed empire begins to crumble as their heirs mysteriously perish one after another, plunging the story into a realm where reality and the supernatural intriguingly blur. It's a fascinating exploration of ambition, secrets, and the unforeseen consequences of unchecked power. Has it not occurred to you that if these coincidences keep happening, that family firewall you've always talked about is being dismantled one brick at a time? Number 5 Fellow Travelers, created by Ron Nicewanner this series chronicles a sweeping romance between two men that spans from the 1950s through decades of social change. Immerse yourself in their tumultuous relationship against the backdrop of historical events like the Vietnam War protests, the disco era, and the AIDS crisis. Their journey, fraught with personal and societal challenges, is a poignant exploration of love, identity, and resilience in changing times. How are we going to see you again? I'm going to look outside and make sure it's clear. Take the stairs. Number 4 Drops of God, created by Kuk Dong Tran. 
based on a beloved manga series and made in an incredibly cool style. The show follows a young French woman who discovers that her father has left her the world's greatest wine collection. But she knows almost nothing about wine, and to claim her inheritance, she must compete in three tests against his father's protege, a brilliant young oenologist who comes from a high-born Japanese family. That's why he wanted you both to battle it out. The winner of the three rounds test will inherit the entire estate, the house, and the wine collection. Number three. We can't finish our research without the grant, and we can't get the grant unless we submit. The work is too important. Lessons in Chemistry is a period drama miniseries created by Lee Eisenberg. Set in the 1950s, this show captures the story of a woman defying societal norms by pursuing her dreams of being a scientist. But she faces challenges due to the prevailing attitudes about women's roles and instead accepts a job on a TV cooking show. But there she embarks on a mission to teach a nation of overlooked housewives way more than recipes. I'm no one. And I need you to understand this. You are what I treasure most in this world. Not because you are pretty, not because you are smart, but because you love me and I love you. And you can try and deny it, but I will not believe you. Number two. What is your problem? What? Beef is a black comedy drama television series created by Lee Sung Jin. This provocative and wicked smart social satire explores the harrowing consequences of a road rage incident. It unravels a twisted feud that consumes its characters, jeopardizing everything and everyone in their lives while exploring their shared humanity and collective hardships. With thought-provoking storytelling about meaning and purpose, this gigantic web of revenge delves into the complex human psyche as the two venture into surreal situations. Gotcha. Before we unveil TV show number one, here are some honorable mentions. You punish yourself with such severity, Pisa. I think you do yourself great harm. Well, insomnia doesn't matter that much. Uh, plenty to do. I'm writing another novel. I think this could be the one. And the University of Buckingham have asked me to be a guest lecturer. Further lacerations were found on back of her head. Impact wounds from some kind of tool. Hammer. Spanner, maybe. I'm telling you this not to shock you. Because I want you all to appreciate what one person did to another person in our city last night. It's late. And you have school tomorrow, so it's time to get a little rest. Okay. <laughs> Good night, sweetheart. He says the most important light is the light you cannot see. What does that mean? Number one. You need to take your time to think it through. No, I don't. What do I do? A Small Light is a biographical drama miniseries created by Joan Rader and Tony Fallon. Shining new light on one of the world's most important stories, World War II and the strategic killing of Jewish people in Nazi Germany. A secretary named Mape Geis risks everything to help her Jewish employer, Otto Frank, father of Anne Frank, hide his family after the German invasion of the Netherlands. Do you agree with our list? Please let us know in the comments. If you want to know more about a particular TV show in this list, you can check out our links in the video description. And for more top 10 TV show videos, be sure to subscribe to Community TV.